All right, how's it going? This is Kolrolf, and welcome back to Frostpunk. So, we've got the Londoners event going on, and last time we worked to, I guess, appease them a little bit, or comfort them, let them know that we're a good place, we'll be fine, don't worry about it, we've got this. And so, I guess by doing that, by evening prayers and sermons and whatnot, and going up the faith um, path, we've uh, added a bunch of things and have dropped the tendency to neutral at the moment, which is good. It'd be nice to turn that around and get these 35 people to actually um, rejoin us, I guess, and um, uh, stop thinking of leaving. Uh, for London. Um, so aside from doing the, um, yeah, the servants and evening prayers for the moment, we'll see what happens, uh, when we get our next, uh, option, uh, in the Book of Laws. Uh, another thing I talked about last time, I'm just pausing because I want to, I don't want the, um, scouts to reach their destination while I'm, uh, explaining a few things to you guys. Uh, last time, the child shelter I'd mentioned um, wasn't exactly sure how it worked, so I looked it up, and sure enough, um, you you do need enough um, child shelters uh, to to deal with all your children, I guess. So this is only dealing with fifteen. That does mean that there's another uh, thirty-one roaming about. Um, even if you don't see them animated, they're they're not um, uh, in our case with the engineer apprentices. They're not helping out in the um, in the workshops. So, gonna build a bunch more uh, children's shelters. Probably build them on this side. Move this road over. Um, yeah, another thing I wanted to do was build an outpost. Um, I think I, I misunderstood last time. I thought that you needed scouts to um, make an outpost. Wow, this thing is ginormous. Nice. Uh, but no, you need to build one of these, which we'd already researched the tech, so let's just slap that down, and we'll need to connect that to a road. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, another thing I was going to do, like I just mentioned, I was going to do that. And I'll get it out like that, I guess. Yeah. And then we'll deconstruct a little bit of road, because I want to use this part. Oh wow, that happens instantly. Huh. Oh. Yeah, that's the other reason why I wanted things on pause, because... Stuff happens! What's going on? Another act of vandalism. The Londoners have defaced more walls, urging everybody to join and abandon the city. Alright. Yeah. Again, we're gonna send a cleric to reassure them that, um... Yeah, hope falls. We're gonna send a cleric to reassure them, and... Hopefully that will... You know... They'll stop defacing things. <laughs> um, so yeah, so gonna build some child shelters. I think I said 31, so you're gonna need, we're gonna need one, 15, and 30 will do. And then we'll just connect them up with the road at the back. Uh, I might have been a little bit inefficient there, but... Ah, well. Can't be perfect, it seems. And in the morning, they'll build those. The children will... Uh-oh. Now what? Cleric beaten. Ooh. And they're really getting nasty. Um, so... Need the faith keepers. Faith keepers secure the streets to strike back. Uh, this is... Hmm... Not, um... Not really sure about these Faith Keepers. Let's, um... I'll pray for him and, and his assailants. 
Let's do that, because the... Let's take a look at the Faith Keepers here. Yeah, this is kind of looking a little bit more forced, a little bit more, you know, forcing people to join the religion as opposed to it being open and allowing people to join or choose as they please. Um, yeah, public penance. Yeah, it's, I'm worried things are going to start going a little bit more of a culty direction as this kind of progresses. We're not going to do the Faith Keepers. I think I'm going to take a look at some of the other things. And, you know, Field Kitchens looked all right. I took a look at that. House of Healing looked fine. Temple looked fine. But we're not going to do Faith Keepers. That's, um, I'm going to draw a line there. Um, what else? Yeah, so we'll get these uh, back to the children's, shel children's shelters. Get those built and get the kids working. It'll be good. Free time's almost over, so we'll, we're just about to start building these things and reconnecting these. So that would be good. And oh, scouts have research, uh, reached the next colony. So let's take a look. Exile colony. Numerous of numerous snow shelters, expertly built from blocks of hardpack snow, huddle around cold, burned-out campfires. Well, there's survivors. It's good. Some exiles are still alive. Oh, that's right. These are the exiles from uh, Tesla City. One of them, one of the dying, held a diary to his chest. We read the last entry. Exiled from Tesla City with food and fuel running out. We sent the strongest among us to search for help. Their last hope. We're afraid that this refers to those poor Yankees we buried. Yeah, we found that um rob the ex no, we're not going to rob them. We're going to escort them back. Goodness. Um, wait, what was I saying? Yeah, we found that um, um a bunch of dead Yankees with uh Advanced prosthetics, and I think that's what, uh, that was our advanced scouting party. We pulled the dying exiles from their snow houses and prepared them for the journey to our city. Some of them stirred from their death like slumber to bless their absent friends for bringing them. Yeah, we couldn't tell them the truth, not yet. Yeah, let's get them settled and then we can worry about the. Harsh reality. All right. Well, uh, let's see. Should be building some of this stuff soon. We're all on free time, and we should be awake. Okay, here come the masses. Oop. There we go. New child shelters, new roads, and the outpost here. Oh, can we? New unit. Oh yeah, waiting for workers. Okay, we'll get to that. We'll get to that once it's built. Good. Okay. Well, a little bit more time. Seven hours and a bit till we can select a new thing. Um, we'll be working on technology-wise. Flying hunters, right. Okay. We'll get that and help our food situation just a little bit more. Oh, there we go, work time. Good. Good, good, good. It's got built. So, also gonna build some resource depots. Um, I'll do that off camera because it's not terribly exciting. And also do a check of how we're doing on the balance of resources if we're, you know, we're gaining or losing on some of these things that help us focus on um, what what to build next. All right, get you in a bit. Uh, okay, okay. So the temple will actually um, hope will rise. Some Londoners will mend their ways. Let's do that then. All right. So yeah, we need to build a temple. But that's fine because I think that will be. What we need to kind of 
make the push. You know, start uh, getting some of these Londoners to come back into the fold. Uh, that would be a perfect spot for <laughs> right beside the, the coal thumper. Um, yep. Yeah. It actually fits perfectly, so let's... Is it the same size as the coal thumper? Just slightly smaller. Wow. It's like it was made for it. Let's do that. And that will get a promise... Uh, fulfilled, as well as get some more people. Um, well, well, hopefully we'll switch this tendency to um, negative tempo built. Hope rises. Perfect. Good, good, good. Let's take a look at that. Alright. Uh, the temple has already influenced some people to mend their ways. Perfect! We're down to 31. Okay, and we haven't even clicked this. So it's going to cost us food rations. Um, yeah, a lot of these seem to cost food rations, but we'll do it. So four days. Yeah, we're going to need to keep an eye on these people who mend their ways. Four wrongdoers. Wrongdoers. <laughs> well, four people with difference of opinion. Boom. There we go. Okay. Good, so let's drop another one. I guess whoop, we got another one another person. Oh, it doesn't hasn't updated yet. That's fine. That's fine. It's tendency still neutral, but Nope. See people going in for a service. Oh yeah. Cool. Oh, the light shut off, and oh, it's time to go. Alright, so yeah, uh, let's see, done a few things to kind of anticipate these guys arriving. Um, we should be fine in terms of medical. Um, we don't really have any patients at the moment. So we've got, uh, if a lot of them are sick, we can um, handle that, as well as um, for uh, job and work, um, We'll get some people assigned to the outpost. We'll also get some people assigned to the hunter's hangers. Um, oh, yeah, so I made more. Um, what do we really need? Wood was peeking out. Oops. And they're back. All right, welcome back, guys. Let's just um, resolve this. We could probably always use more coal space. Wood is pretty tapped out, and uh, yeah, let's do coal. Sure, why not? We can always build more, and I don't really care about splattering them all over the place because you don't need to keep track of them. It's not uh, doesn't need to be efficient. Okay, so we got lots of people, so let's make an outpost team and send them to the coal mine. And every one day. Perfect. And these guys. These guys. Okay, there. Uh, nope, not our city. Come on. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay, yep. Yeah. Dreadnought landing. Send our guys there. Okay, good. They went. These guys are still en route to Freshwater Springs them a little while to get there. All right, and let's sign homeless. That shouldn't be. Okay, that'll probably resolve itself in just a moment because the tents are already built and waiting for them. And for some reason that one's cold. Ah, oh, it's just outside. Uh, and this one's also just outside. Ah. Okay, well you guys are prime candidates for becoming houses as soon as possible. And in the meantime, might make... Hmm, well, you know what? Oh, good. Just saw this. Tendency of going down. Perfect. Um, let me think about that. Uh, I guess we can build some more tents over here, but we'll probably need another steam hub. And... Uh, 
The resource that we're really running out of right now is steel. So they may be uh, what we run to in terms of uh, technology is, yep, different section, jump down to steelworks. Actually, once we get that, we can jump down to advanced steelworks. We might just go bang bang and uh, skip actually building steam steelworks, because that's our only, those are our only two methods of making steel at the moment. So I've been taking a look at the technology tree, and I think what we're going to do is we're going to go for house redesign, and Ooh, unless we don't... Oh, okay, so we'll wait. Ugh. <laughs> Dang it. Ah, uh, we're all working, so we'll get that in, in just a moment. Um, let's just set it to slow. And that'll click up. Um, thinking we'll go for house redesign with this cold snap uh, coming. It's more than a cold snap, I guess. It's dropping quite a bit. Uh, we're going to start converting all these um, tents over to houses. There we go. House redesign. And this will um, cost 10 wood, but 10 steel less for all of them. So that uh, will help us out quite a bit. Because uh, we've got a lot of houses to build. And yeah, steel's a bit of a a tight commodity for us right now. Let's see, the only other thing... We've got a bunch of... I'm hoping engineers can work at the coal mine, because uh, they're the only ones that I don't have employed at the moment, and I guess we could build another workshop? Yeah, maybe that's not a bad idea. Just them to good use. Let's, um, okay, the coal mine's being built. Let's just wait a moment and see what this looks like. And from there we'll see if we want another workshop. Five seems like, oh, I don't know, maybe five is fine. Maybe we just build a whole ton of them. Okay, good. Engineers can work here. Um, why is it an operative? Uh oh, something happened. Waiting, uh, there we go. Build outpost, yes, please do that. Uh, nope, don't dismantle it, just, uh, good. Oh, there's the transport. Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, did I mess up on the road? Is that what, what the issue is? We're building it, right? Not sure what's wrong here. Street not connected. Um, maybe it's somewhere else that it's not. Ugh. Okay, that's the problem. It's it's done to there, but I thought there was a road there. It wasn't. Oh, now what's up? What's up? What's up? Change of heart. Sir, a man was find, found crying silently in the temple. We approached him to ask if he needed help. He told us he wanted to see you. I thought my face died long ago, sir, with my wife and daughters in London. Comes any purpose in our new life, in the fight for survival, but, but, day, but today I entered the temple, I saw a future. I'm ready to face it. I'm glad to hear that. Ah, he was a Londoner, too. Okay. Yep. No. No worries, my good man. We'll all get through this somehow. House redesign researched. Alright. So with that... Um, I think the next step... Um, I'm a little worried about how cold things are going to be. Maybe this will do one building. This will do healthcare, but they're not really hurting. Um, hmm. let's do the cookhouse. Yeah, yeah. Let's just do the cookhouse because it's. We can turn that heater off then, and 
Yeah, we don't even have the heaters on these things, so yeah. It's only one building. I've only got one cookhouse, because, I don't know, they seem to take care of everything. Don't really have people getting hungry, don't see the need for building more. So... Yeah. We need more raw food. <laughs> oh, scouts have reached freshwater springs. Let's take a look at that. Alright, several pools are kept from freezing by hot springs deep underground. Degenerated but alive. Oh, there's people here. Uh, near the freshwater springs, we met some refugees from Winterholm, our sorry site and seem to be completely unmoved by the fate of their city. Asked what kept them from starving, they look away and then mumbled something about Eakin eating lichens. Yeah. Yeah. Let's escort you guys back and get you a, um, a real meal. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's a... Uh, Harsh world. Oh, time for new law. Ah, purpose has has re has changed its uh, splash screen uh, righteous denunciation. Due to the fable, faithful to denounce wickedness, sign true compassion, bring the wicked to light. Is uh, hmm, yeah. Small amount of this kind of sounds like ratting out your neighbor. Uh, yeah. Okay. Let's, um. Oh, yeah. Field kitchens. Yeah, so this will actually, um. Uh, raise the temperature in workplaces, which are notoriously hard for some of them to. And then, let's see the other one. Oh, yeah. House of Healing. But we're doing pretty good. We'll get. I think we'll grab that one, but, um. Let's get field kitchens. We're kind of doing okay for managing all the, the sick people um, in the infirmary and the various uh, medical posts. That's what I'm trying to say. So yeah, uh, field kitchens. Let's see what faith field. Oh, they're pretty big. Serves hot people. Need steel, of course. Of course, they need steel because everything needs steel. Ugh. Um, well, they're not too big. Hmm, let's see. Can I fit in? Ooh, I can fit it in there. That hits a bunch of them. It's not too many of these things that, um... Just outside of reach of that one. Okay. Oh, unless... Yeah, no, we'll put it there. Maybe put one on the other side. I'm sure we'll need one over here eventually. Uh, what other buildings light up? Cookhouse. <laughs> uh, okay, so a food kitchen for the cookhouse, that works. Um, sure. Oh, can we fit in there? No, I can't. Just hits that corner. Um, hmm. Where else? Yeah, it's kind of a funny building to hit. Mm. Yeah, there's just not really going to be any good answers to any of this, is there? It's just a tiny building. Yeah, it doesn't affect these. Okay. Well, we need to build two. Actually, it doesn't... It's the same size as the gathering depots. So maybe... Maybe that works. Um... Not. Hmm. Yeah, we'll just slap one down there, and may end up moving some of these resource depots elsewhere, just to the edge of the map, um, and tucking them away at the back because um, they don't need to be heated. They don't care about anything. It doesn't, it doesn't really matter. Okay, so I guess once these get built, we'll have that um, complete, and then. Yeah, this... Oh, look, here comes our flying hunters. <laughs> That's neat. Um, yeah, I'll have to decide where else makes sense to put them. 
Okay. Oh. Ah, scouts have reached the Dreadnought Landing. So this is part of... This seems to be the American camp area. Huge ship was, has been dismantled here. Wow. We found a piece of hull plate bolted to a, boil, a boulder. Bolted to a boulder. It's engraved with the following inscription. In the year 1886, the American expedition aboard Hephaestus, probably pronounced that wrong, uh, landed here in search of a haven from global glaciation. Uh, sites discovered, test the city. Well, take the resources. Okay. And I just got resources, so let's head to Tesla City. Large settlement, numerous buildings. Okay. Good stuff. Um, yeah, so we're still... Hmm. Oh yeah, so we've got these. Oh, they do require workers. Well, that's not bad. I just gotta, um... Help me all serve. Don't have any people. Well, I guess we do have some people coming back at the moment. And, for that matter, we're gonna need to build them some houses or something. Oh, do you go to the nearest... Okay. Come to that steam hub instead of the generator then, because I guess it's closer. Ah, neat. Well, if you don't mind, excuse us. Oh, cookhouse installation. Let's just pause for a second. Let's... 15 steel, I can make 3. And I need 3. Well... Yeah, okay, let's just start building these. Um, yeah, hoping to convert some, but I guess this is the furthest out ring, so it's, it's at least not a waste to three, and that'll house, yeah, we're out of steel, but this will house the next couple of people. And add new research. Hmm. Housing insulation. Yeah, but if we can get uh, a bunch of things. Let's see. Actually, it may depend on what doesn't need steel, which is probably going to be not everything. Oh! Hmm. Steam steel works. Faster outpost teams, that's. Yeah, I think we're at the point where everything is going to require steel. Oops. So, yeah, let's... Let's do that. Okay. Scouts have returned. Scouts have reached Tesla City. Okay. So that... Um, let's get these guys sorted first. Or should we go to Tesla City? Let's go to test the city. These guys. Okay. City is modern and meticulously built. Huh. <laughs> Hopefully that shows up on the video. You can see electricity arcing over that large building. Thunder unleashed. Able minds and bodies will prevail over the cold, reads the slogan the entrance of, to Tesla City. The central tall tower shines with the blue glow of electric discharges, which form a protective glow over the dome over the town? Okay. But something went wrong here. There are charred bodies lying in the streets and a stench of burnt, burnt flash taints here. Ugh. <laughs> Risk entering the city. Stay away. Ah. Wow. Okay. <laughs> uh, this reminds me of an adventure path where your party opens the door and sees a large, expensive-looking gem on the floor of the next room. 
But if you look around the room, you see charred remains, burned objects, and like a, a blast radius emanating from the gem. And you kind of realize the gem's actually a trap. Unless you just jump in without looking and grab the treasure and kaboom. <laughs> Is that... that's just a risk, right? Should we risk it? Oh, I don't know. Let's risk it. We've seen a thing or two in our lives with nothing has ever frightened us as much as this blasted lightning until we figured out how to switch it off, that is. Now we've been able to establish an outpost here. Whew! They made it. Steam cores every day? Wow. Holy smokes. That's, um... Well, let's go to the fishing village, but, um, I guess we didn't get any... Didn't get any resources there, but... That's, a uh, Steam cores for days. Hmm. Interesting. Well... These guys have returned. So let's send them out to the Frozen Grove. It'll take them ages to get there. Um, like, we do have five steam cores and not necessarily a whole lot of buildings to... Well, maybe I shouldn't say that. I mean, this game is offering us steam cores per day. You know. Oops, didn't mean to click that. I mean, click that off. There we go. Um, maybe we will need more down the road than I think. Should also check on this. I found the temple is perfect for, um, checking to see the cooldowns on everything, because it, it can do all of them. Um, the houses of prayer don't. Oh, and a few more people have turned away. So seven days, seven and a half days, basically we're down to 17 people. I think we're gonna get there. I think we're gonna get there handily. We'll convince these people that it'll be a suicide run to go back to London, so stick with us. Good. Alright, um... Oh, that temperature drop is coming really, really quick. It's the middle of the night. Um... Mm, I'm worried if we set some of these to, uh be converted into houses, they'll do it right away and throw people on the street while it waits, and that, um, it's a two-level temperature drop, so I think that means down to minus 60. Whew. Okay, that is cold. <laughs> oh, scouts have reached Fishing Village. Oh, that's right, because that was just near, um, Tesla City hot spring keeps a tiny patch of sea from freezing here. Yeah. Uh, this fishing village used to supply Tesla City with food. Searching it, we found a letter. Mike, don't return to the city. Tesla is a madman. He cast out all the amputees, all the sick. Ugh, Jerry's parrots and old Beth are among them. There will be blood for sure soon. Uh, mm -hmm, maybe there's a bit of an uprising and uh, that's what spelled the end. Um, we could send a team here to start fishing. Dismantle it. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Well, wood is not really a concern, and we get the two cores, so let's leave it intact. And this will... food. Ah, uh, this is a food village. Yeah, that makes sense. It's a fishing village, of course. Okay, let's see where should we send these guys. Ice corridor, a wide lane of crushed ice extends to the shore as far as the eye can see. Obviously left the American Dreadnought. Okay. And a research station. Oddly shaped building bristling with various antennas and instruments. Hmm. Let's go to the research station. Maybe the, we'll get a little bit more lore out of it. Um, this you know, 
brush dice. That doesn't really look interesting at all, and there doesn't appear to be anybody there or any, any kind of interest. Uh, all right. Oh, now what? Food theft. Guys. Someone has stolen 15 food rations from the stockpiles. People are staying with the Londoners gathering supplies for their journey. <laughs> well, it's still negative and going down. No, we don't have faith keepers, and we're going to let them be. Not because we want to let them be, but... You know. 15 food rations. We'll survive that. Although we only have about 59 left. Anyways. Yeah. No, we're not gonna hunt. <laughs> we're gonna hunt them down like dogs. Mm. Yep. Theft is a crime, but uh, not that I'm condoning it. But um, thinking if we can convince them all to stay, the food may miraculously show up again. Okay. Well, it's in the morning. We'll switch these houses over. And uh, workers. Hmm. You know, maybe that's the thing to do. Element one. We build another one of these and start sending a team. Yeah, let's do that and get tons of food. Because there's another look. Oop. Spin the town around. There it is. Off here. That and how are we gonna connect this up? Um, we'll just run it straight along the building here, straight along the house of bear. Okay, we'll do that. We'll send them. We'll send those guys. Ten of those guys. We've got. Oh no, everyone's everyone's come back. Okay, so yeah. Okay. That'll be the plan. We'll send, we'll make a new outpost de team. Get tons of food. We'll stockpile tons of food. And we'll be able to keep all these things running that require food. <laughs> uh, I hate to look at our food budget right now. Oh, it's actually not too bad. We're only, we actually are ahead ever so slightly, but um, cool. Okay. Well, this will mean we'll be, uh, when we get that outpost built, we'll have tons of food coming in. People abandon the Londoners, that's right. That's right, you don't need to steal food rations from us, you can just stick with us. That would be better. Oh, uh, requires 20 food rations. Mm. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. And we should have more food coming in soon. These guys are these guys should all be returning returning shortly, so we'll We'll be okay. I'm sure of it. Well, I'm not sure of it. We'll be okay. <laughs> yeah, we're definitely gonna be um looking at the heater tech. <laughs> uh well, luckily it's going to be going back to minus 40 in a couple of days, but until then, it's a mite bit cold. Okay. Well, I think we'll leave that for next time. Um, in this depot... Oh, actually, let's get this set up. Because there's a risk that I will forget. Perfect. Food incoming. All right, well, we'll leave it there for now. Getting tense, getting exciting. <laughs> uh, managing all these poor people. Okay. <sighs> all right. Thanks everyone for watching. Catch you in the next one. Take care.